Here at the 2019 MLS Super Draft with goalkeeping coach John Pascarella. Well, first pick in the draft for Minnesota United, number seven overall, Dane St. Clair. I know you're tight with Maryland coach Sasha Sarovsky. What do you have to say about this goalkeeper in this pick? It's a, it's a very good pick for us. It's a pick for the future. I know people sometimes want to see production right away, but the kid has tremendous tools. Um, I know a lot of people like to compare him to Zach Steffen, and when you look at him, there are those physical similarities, um, but they are very different people. They're different styles of goalkeepers, but he has a tremendous amount of talent, and if we can harness that energy and that talent, I think we've got a good one for the future. Well, you keep talking about the future, but at the same time, Minnesota United only has one goalkeeper on their roster. But coming in as a rookie, particularly in that position, is a difficult, it's a tall task. So what can he learn from you and from Bobby Shuttleworth? Well, it's interesting that you say that, first of all, because he does have a tremendous opportunity in front of him because of the way the roster makeup is right now. Um, if he's smart, which I believe he is, um, I think that there's a lot for him to learn. Bobby has been around the league for a long time and in a couple different situations and teams. So if the kid's a good learner and a quick learner, the opportunities in front of him are endless. Well, and you guys do the interviews with the players at the Combine. So as you talk about willingness to learn and listen, how important is that when you're doing the interviews that these kids have a little bit of swagger and confidence, but at the same time, they're willing to learn from those in front of them? Yeah, that, that, that's actually right. That was nice in terms of the relationship that I have with Sasha, to be able to dig in a little bit into the kid's background and find out how coachable he is and how willing he is to learn and, and change things that he's done already and, and to try to improve himself. And all those things, he ticks all the right boxes. So, like I said, I think he's going to be a great one for the future. Well, we know college is college, but winning a national championship isn't too shabby, and that's good experience playing in a big game. So I'm sure we'll be seeing you in a couple of weeks back in Minnesota. Yeah, we'll see you in a couple of weeks. The kid did do a great job with his team and a strong program, so we expect a lot from him. Thanks, JP. Thank you.